So, I think from the look of things, she's a nice woman to bring her in. How long should I be going out, going out, going out? Dad, where are you, sir? Oh, Lisa, how are you? I'm fine, Dad. I don't know if you'll be able to understand this same way like me. You know, ever since your mom left, this house has been boring, loneliness, or lowly, somehow, somehow. And there's this woman I've been hanging out with all this while. She made me feel a lot, like, remind me of your mom. So, I'm just meditating on, like, bringing her home. Dad, don't bring any woman to the, uh, this house, right? No, I, I understand, I understand. Yeah. See, my daughter, I understand your feeling. I understand. But try to understand me too. You are still a kid, that is why you don't know what it takes for a man to stay for like five, six months without a woman beside him. So please, and please, try to understand me in this case. And then, before I forget, that reminds me. There was a time you asked for mobile phone, right? Yes, yeah, Dad. That's good. I've ordered for it. I just want it to be a surprise. Thank you, you Dad. You know, I always want you to be happy. Same way I want you to make me happy. So please, would you like me to be happy? Yes. Then do this for me. Let her come in. And please understand her. Okay. Respect her like your mom. Whatever she talk to you, respond with respect. Don't be rude to her. And whatever she do anything you don't like, don't react. Keep it to yourself. If I'm back or whenever I'm back, explain everything to me. Okay. If I see she's going against my law, I'll kick her out. Trust me for that. I really want you to be happy. Okay? Yeah, so what were you doing inside then? Eh? I was watching that thing. Okay, okay. So you can go and continue. And thanks for your understanding. And as for your phone, tomorrow morning you'll get it. That's my daughter. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah. So finally. So you see, wow. I'm very happy. Mm -hmm. hmm? You make me happy. Wow. You're welcome <laughs> once again. Thank you. You have a nice day. Um, before I ask of what to offer you, you know, I haven't told you this before, but I've been waiting for a very uh, moment like this. I have a daughter. You have a, a daughter? A very beautiful daughter is that. Yeah, I have wow. one daughter. You know, I told yeah, you about my ex-wife. So she had one. We had one daughter together. So before this, then, so as time goes on, I believe. And I, I want you to understand, you know, she's a kid. So treat her and handle her like your own daughter. Okay? okay. So what can I offer you? You just give me water. Okay. Yeah. So I will send for that. To avoid time, uh, much time or time wasting. Can we go this evening to your place and pack some of your little belongings for it, for us to come back this, this evening, evening or tomorrow? I don't want to waste much time for, uh, on that again. Okay. Let's make it tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning. Yeah. Okay. Look. Definitely you will spend the night. You are not going back. Because I would like to go back with you and pick it and we will come back together. Yeah. Okay. No so problem. here is way to the bedroom. You can have your shower there, then and meet. Your wardrobe is there, then you change into any of my clothes. I, I believe my clothes will size you. Yeah. And also, it's going to be funny. Put on my clothes and let's see how it will look like on you. <laughs> I want to wear it. You're welcome. Thank you. Yeah. Wow. What is the best happy thing a man can get than to have a good, good, good woman? Okay. Every day you come here and come and watch me. I need my brother. I need my brother. Since you came here three years, I've never given birth. Give birth. Lisa. Am I dreaming or what? No, you're not dreaming. What's going on here? I'm your mother. You are not my mother. My mother can give birth. Why is that you? Only you cannot give birth. So, since when they started? Huh? And who give you that authority to come and talk to me anyhow, just like that, because of not giving birth? Huh? Give I'm birth. Really sure. Give birth. My father told me that you are here to give birth and now you have not give birth. Why? Eliza. Talking to me like that. I'm even surprised. Wow. 
Steel. Eyes. Because of not giving them. Wow. <laughs> this sad. Sort me just like that. Because I don't have a child. Eliza! Eliza! Dad. Come here. Where is that bad woman? That woman. Where is she? She's in the room. Go and quiet for me, please. Hmm. You are just here and spend my brother's money. That's all you know. It's been like three years now. Ah. Hmm. She come and meet me here. Hmm. Dad. She's yeah. coming. She's coming, right? Yes. All right. My husband, you are here. Who is your husband? Huh? Who is your husband? Sit down. So, Why? are you happy always working alone? Okay. So Why how many years know? have you been here? Huh? Three years. Three years. And you are excited just saying three years, right? I don't understand it. Too. You don't understand? Why how do many kids have you produced? Huh? You've been here for the past three years. I've never heard the cry of a baby. What kind of woman are you? Or are you just here spending my brother's money or what? Will you please calm down? Well, I should calm down. Did you say I should calm down? Ah! Just three years. All what you know is just watching television, just eating. What was that? Eliza, you know what? You are my daughter. Okay? And I want us to do something. Have you seen the woman over here? The one who can't give it? Yes. Good. This is what I want us to do. I spoke to her this morning and the way she spoke to me, I never liked it. And you are the only person who can maltreat her the way I want it. Okay? Now, this is what we are going to do. You know that your father is not here. Okay? So, any time this woman comes to the kitchen to even take something to eat, don't allow her to take it. Make sure you lock everything over here. The only time that she can get access to food is when we hear the cry of a baby. Is that okay? okay. So, if she tells you to clean, don't clean. If she calls you that go and buy her something, don't go. Did you hear what I said? Yes. Did you hear me? Yes. Don't do anything that she tells you. We are going to maltreat her until she leaves this house. Because we can't just allow somebody like this to be in this house. What does she do? Just eating, watching television, doing unnecessary things. Did you hear me? Yes. So that is what we are going to do in this house. When she comes here and don't do anything that she tells you. Did you hear me? Okay. And then I'm going to talk to your brother too. Very soon, your brother has to divorce this woman because we can't accept her in our family. Your mom was even better. At least she gave birth to one, one daughter. You've been here for the past three years. One, two, three, three years without a cry for baby. And when I talked to her, she was like, she's not God. And so that's what I want you to do for me. Whenever she tells you to do something, don't do it. Do you hear me? Okay. If I come here and see that you are doing something which she has already told you to do, I will never and ever talk to you again. Is that okay? okay. More treat her. You want her to leave this house. By the time your father comes, she'll be out. Is that okay? This place is very dirty. She didn't even wash the utensils. Very untidy place. Oh God. Eliza. Eliza. Hmm? How are you calling me? So you heard it? Yes. And you didn't respond? Yes. 
Hey, this girl, please, can you please watch the intensives for me? No, because I'm not the maid of this house. Really? Yes. You, but you are the child of this house. But so you too, you have hands. responsibility to wash it. You too, you have, you have hands to wash. So wash. It's your mother you are talking to, or are you, you have forgotten? Yeah, I'm not my mother. I'm not your mother. Yeah. Like seriously. Wow. Eh? Wash yo. You don't wash. You hear what my father said? Two months. You hear? What kind of marriage is this? You can't continue this marriage again. Uh -uh. What's the meaning of all this? Mm -hmm. I have to call him. Inform him everything. If not, I will leave. Yeah, Helen. Good afternoon. Yeah, I'm good and you. We thank God. Yeah, I'm not fine. What's going on in this house? I'm not okay with it. By the time you'll be here, you won't see me. Yeah, I can't continue this anymore just because I've not given birth. Oh no, I can't. You have to come and solve this, this thing out because it's too much. Okay. 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 It's too much for me. Especially your daughter. Talk to me anyhow. I can't take it anymore. It's too much. So you have to come. Okay. See you. Bye bye. What kind of marriage is this? Eliza! Eliza! This girl. She won't even mind me. Why are you calling me? Please get me water. Me, I should get you water. Yes. Me. Hmm. You don't know the person you're talking to. Give birth and let the kid I'm go talking to water. my daughter. Who's water? Now you have to give birth. No. You're not talking to any daughter. You're not talking to any daughter. Me, and my mother is not. from all this. So you can't show me little respect but just because I'm not giving birth. Yes. God have mercy on you. So, yeah, I'm back. I'm back. I've reached home. Yeah, thank you. Yo, thanks for calling. Thanks for calling. Oh, my wife. She's fine. She's fine. She's fine. She's even coming. Yeah, she's coming out. Okay, she will here. Yeah, I'll greet her for you. All right. Thank you. Ah, my beautiful woman. What is wrong? You are not looking happy. What is the problem? Are you okay? Yeah. Are you sure? Tell me. I know. Whenever you start putting on this face, something is wrong. What is the problem? Talk to me. It's your brother and your daughter. What happened this time around again? But you remember what I informed you on the phone? Yeah, I understand. Yeah. They maltreated me, sorting me. I understand. In order to cut the story short, okay? Oof, I'll, you know, you are not marrying to them. You are marrying to me. But the truth is that... So, they are from happy, all this excuse pressure... Me, excuse me. The truth is that they are playing their own part as a family, as a loving family, as a caring family. You understand? Put yourself in my shoe. Assuming I haven't got any child before, maybe you are the first woman I met. By the, by the so, grace of God, you have I one. I had one. But so I so, should be the see, one complaining. Excuse me. Since you have me beside you, don't look at them with bad eye or mindset. They don't have any bad intention against you. They are only trying to protect me or play their own role as a loving and caring family. Okay? But it the should kind be of person I am, way. the kind of person I am, I can't. The way your daughter insults me. My daughter? Ah. As for her, I will talk to her because she Call has the right to who will invite her in this uh, in this situation. But I was thinking, I'm thinking of something like, let's try and 
meter. This is my friend, the doctor. Then from there, we can also meet some man of God and see what is happening. Just play along with them. They are only doing their part and I will talk to them. Okay. Mm -hmm. Just believe whatever I say to them in your presence. I'm just trying to confuse them. I'm at on your side. I'm on your side. You are my wife and I love you. And we love each other. That is the best I know thing. you love me. So, and I love you too. But you better talk to them. I will talk it's to too them. much for me. Don't take it like it's more. They are doing their part. Okay. The kind of person, you know me, the kind of man, uh, man I am, I can't but do because of much. the love I have for you not to follow or to judge the right thing. No family member will have his man or his, will, uh, the, the, you know, we have, we are only two men in our family, me and my brother. Even his my junior brother. So the everyone are looking up to me to multiply in the family, to bring more children. So please, try and understand with them. And as for me, I will never leave you because of that. I will do whatever I take, fight with you to the end. So like what I was saying, let's try and see my friend, the doctor. When we see him, then from there, we we'll go and check. There's this man of God ahead of, we'll meet him up. And from there, I think God in heaven, the maker of heaven and earth, the creator of life and soul will never forsake us. Okay? Amen. Just, I always want you to be happy. Be happy. Smile for me. Congratulations, my friend. Thank you, thank you. Dr. Yeah, Christ. Um, yes. According to the test, we run the test, both you and your wife. Mm -hmm. There is nothing wrong with you, both of you. That's good. Okay. Yes. Um, good to hear you, that. Yes. You just a matter of time. You don't need to worry or your wife being worried. Just leave everything to God. Okay. Very soon, you people will have a baby. Thank you, thank you, yes. thank you. I really appreciate No problem. You're welcome. Before you go, I have some medication to give you and your wife okay and also you need to be eating a lot of fruits you and your wife so don't uh, mind whatever people say about your wife all right thank yeah. you mm. so let me get this okay medication for you you see what i was telling you huh? day and night crying weeping telling me this and that and that and that there is nothing wrong with me and you same way nothing is wrong with you you don't worry so I can have see. to go with this. Okay. Wow. You can see the little baby. This is how. <laughs> Smile. Hmm? Just be happy. So, Dr. Christ. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. So. Wow. It's been a while. Yeah. You're welcome. Thank friend. you. Thank you. Thank you. Then some other time, I will mm -hmm. give you a call no once problem. I wish. Okay. Yeah, Take we have a lot to talk to discuss. No problem, okay, no concerning you know now yes. ah, the yes. other side. Like I said, yeah. all right. Yeah. Oh, no problem. Okay, thank you. Yeah, no God problem. bless. No problem. Yeah, you are welcome. At least you have to show me a little respect. <laughs> Uh, you have what is going on here? That she has been beating me since you travel. Hey. Are you sure? Yes. Is that how you are? So you have been her. You. How can I do that? Wait, excuse me. Sit down. Mm. For the fact that I've been supporting you in all this uh, issue of predicament, or shy, whatever, whatever, that doesn't guarantee you to beat my daughter. Hey, but it's not true. It's the Linda last thing is lying. I will ever take from you. Mm. Eliza. How can she, and she's crying. <laughs> <laughs> and by the way, what were you doing with her? I just she asked her to get the water. That's all. Elisa, why? Mm. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, wipe your tears. It's okay. Please. Is that how you are? After all, you haven't you haven't gave me any. Baby, so thank you. The one who has this girl, she's just lying. She haven't said. Have she said anything like this on you before? So why now? Why beating her? <laughs> this this has to be the beginning and the last. Please and please, if you don't want me, if you don't want to see the other side ah, of me, bro, ah, what's going on? Imagine, are you, ah, why are you crying? She's she beating her. Beat Even from the part of what she's saying, she has been beating her ever since I traveled. Bro, that Babe, is I said don't trust them. It's true. What, 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 what is true, Elisa? Am I beating no, you? Yes. That's what she has been doing. Hey. Since you left. And you, you, you this girl, you can't. Can. 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 What can I do? 
That's your woman. I can't beat her, right? She's the only thing. She's everything I have now. She's the only no, thing. Listen, I have listen. Listen. Don't trust me anymore. I trust you, but that doesn't. Both of them are just lying. That doesn't mean that she's broke my daughter. Mm. But see, it's true. That's what she has been doing. Mm. How can she be lying and my mm. brother be lying too? Mm. Yes, mm. it's true, bro. This woman, eh, love to stack it. That's the reason why you pretend that Steve are beating you. Ah, bro, that's it. That's what I have to tell you. Now, that's what I have to tell you from today. Listen and listen attentively, carefully. Listen very well from today. Anything happen that she ever complain of you beating, raising your hand, raising your sticky hand on her, you will see the other side of me. Bro, you just have to say what is all this? You just have to say it. After all, she has not given back for the past three years. Oh, I don't want to talk about this issue. She's my number one happiness. You are just here as a supporter. So you don't trust me. It's okay. Come close. It's okay. It's okay. Elisa. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. I'm sorry. And you. Sit down. Tell me, how do you expect me to believe that she's lying? I've been staying with her for years, ever since her mom left before you came in. She haven't done, even haven't made a letter or made her cry for once, for some second, even for five seconds. What is all this? I think I know what to do about this. Because sometimes you girls, you woman, if someone gives you a true love or trust, you begin to pass your band. Yeah. Are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. My wife. My life, hey. a beautiful number one in life. <laughs> Love it. So, like we're saying, will you escort me to that place on Every this weekend? Day. I feel for God. Are you okay? Are you sure? Are you sure? Yes, Babe, you are not okay. Yes, no, you are not fine. fine from the look of things. See, I need. I think we need to see my friend, Doctor Christ. The doctor. Yeah. We need to. You are not fine from the look of things. You are I not fine. I'm fine. Today uh -huh. happened to be one of the best, happiest. Day. Day. So you are going to prepare the food once again. I remind you. Remember my remember favorite. Am... <laughs> <laughs> Bro. Bro, yeah. What happen. Oh, haven't you heard? Heard what? Come, Fine. my beautiful daughter. What's you are going now on? going to have a bouncing fine brother. My wife is pregnant. <laughs> Who is pregnant? She's pregnant. So why your cup? Let's celebrate. <laughs> She's pregnant. She's pregnant. Are you surprised? Uh, hmm. You see your face. So, it can wow. never be delayed. It can never no, be changed. Uh, Destiny can be delayed. It's okay. But can I, no, let me give. Now, today is our happiest day. No prepare. There is no prepare today. No prepare today. Whatever we are giving, we give in double and bundle. Double hey. and double. Ah. Oh, let's all be happy for her. Upcoming you brother. No, let her be happy for her upcoming brother. Yes. Okay, you are not Today you. we are giving him okay, bundle. Wow. I have no chance. So she, she is pregnant. Lisa, I've told your yes. mom. She is preparing my favorite I, food today. Go and join her in the kitchen. Okay? My friend Dr. Christ will still be here. Okay. Yeah. Bro. Alright, so I'll be I'll be in my room. Okay? All right, all right, all right. So, and uh, put a put call across to mom that she shouldn't worry again. You know, she has been worried that my wife don't want to give her grandchild. Okay, okay. The she Lord has done it. <laughs> Eliza, I hope you are happy. Your brother will soon come. Oh, why won't she be happy? Don't say that. Don't say that. Don't blame them. They did all that to protect me in the case Good. of you no know, family love. So, babe, let's toast. And again. <laughs> 